Today was day two of the trial of Stacy Valencourt, a former daycare provider accused of causing the death of a six month old baby she was caring for at her daycare in Rutland. Valencourt allegedly gave the infant a fatal dose of an over the counter medication to make her sleep. NBC 5's Jack Thurston joins us now live in studio with more on what happened in the courtroom today, Jack. Well, Liz, today prosecutors called several witnesses to the stand. Many were medical personnel who cared for six-month-old Harper Rose Breyer on the day she died. EMTs testified they were called to Stacey Valencourt's home daycare in late January of 2019 for the report of an unresponsive infant. When they got to the daycare provider's home, they couldn't provide or they couldn't find a heartbeat on little Harper. They began CPR and inserted a breathing tube, desperately trying any life-saving measures they could as they made their way to the emergency room at Rutland Regional Medical Center. Doctors said they tried everything they could for almost an hour before declaring the six-month-old baby dead. And what did you tell Harper's family? Uh, I told them that we were nearing the 45-minute mark since the time that paramedics kind of started to care for her. And there, there are various things that we look for, which, which might be a sign, which might be a positive sign. It might be a sign that, that we're gonna be able to reverse this or to turn this around. And I didn't see any of those signs. Now, the trial continues tomorrow. If convicted of manslaughter and child cruelty, Valancourt could face up to 25 years in prison. We'll, of course, keep you updated on developments from that trial here on NBC5 News and on MyNBC5.com. Live in the studio, I'm Jack Thurston, NBC5 News.